Hey guys, Mike, Kilo Kilo 6 Whiskey Bravo Sierra. Today I had a little project. I took down my ZS6 BKW uh, that was hanging in an inverted V uh, with the apex up here at about 32 feet. And I took it down today because I had some SWR issues on all of the bands that's supposed to be resonant for. And the SWRs were coming in um, around between like three and like six in all the bands. And I'm like, okay, this is, there's something wrong. Um, so I don't know if I had the, maybe the ladder line was twisted or something was wrong with one of the, with the wires or something. It's the connections weren't good or something. So I decided to take it down and take a, a look at it. Um, I just got it down and believe me, it was a pain to take down because of primarily these insulators. This one fared fine. It's still intact. Everything's good. The other one, um, I yanked it a little too hard and the insulator came off. So I guess I can't really complain because that's all that really happened to the antenna. So um, anyway, this bucket, this temporary bucket, and I say temporary, but it's been up here for a year. I've been using it up against this fence here. Um, had water in it, or it had water inside the, the tube here. I don't know if that would have any bearing on the SWR because it doesn't really touch the antenna. Strange things could happen, right? I don't know. Maybe maybe that moisture in there is causing an issue, but I don't really think so. I think, I don't know if the twisted ladder line maybe could do some things if it was coming off at weird angles from the tree. Um, I need to do a better job when I put it back up, make sure everything is nice and straight. Um, I don't know. Any ideas why the SWRs might be high? If anyone wants to drop them in the comments, I'd really appreciate it. Um, Cause I'd like to do my, whatever due diligence I can do before um, I stick this sucker back up in the air. So uh, anyway, just thought I would show you guys my, my mess that I have here uh, right now with my ZS six BKW antenna. I think it's a pretty good antenna. I mean, I've made a lot of QSOs all around. Um, not a whole lot of DX, um, uh, mostly a lot of, um, I'm in California. So I, I do get a lot of, uh, QSOs, um, on the East coast and Arizona and uh, a lot in Idaho and some in Hawaii. Um, but I, I feel like there's something still missing with this thing. And I, I think there could be just a problem with this. I, I don't know. I'm thinking maybe just, maybe if I just take it down and try to put it up a little bit higher and make sure those legs are straight in the inverted V, make sure they're not sort of off at different angles. Maybe that will help. Um, I don't know if anyone has any ideas, they want to drop them in the comment. I'm, I think I'll probably wait until next week to put this thing up so I can do a little research. But anyway, I'll be off the air for a while. Kilo Kilo 6 Whiskey Bravo Sierra, 73s.